Richard reached out to me. I actually have done a very similar project on a documentary level. I have made a film called Torn from the Flag. It's a feature-length documentary about the fall of communism and the Hungarian Revolution of 1956. And I have worked on that project for nine years. It was actually quite successful. We went all the way to the Oscars, and we have been invited to 20 festivals. So Richard reached out to me because he felt I would be a good partner to make this film with him and support him in this project. So we're figuring out how I can be part of this. In your line of work, I guess you get um, approached by a a lot of different people looking looking for help, and I suppose you can't help them all. So why in particular this project? Well, you know, I'm Hungarian. I was born in Hungary, uh, born and raised. Currently, I live in in Hollywood (laughs) because I am a filmmaker. And, you know, there aren't a lot of projects on this particular topic. So it it was an easy choice for me. It's very close to my heart. I really do believe that the 1956 Hungarian Revolution is one of the best stories of the 20th century. Uh, It is also very much underpublicized. So it's a natural choice for me. I love this topic. Of course, it's also an underdog story. So everybody loves underdog stories. Richard himself is an underdog, being not a a professional filmmaker, but he's managed to, to get this far. Do a lot of people sort of fall at this hurdle and and do you think he's got a a good chance of making it all the way to the silver screen? Oh, most definitely. And the reason I think that is because not being a professional filmmaker, as you said, I think passion is a really good way to judge uh, someone's professionalism, actually. And the fact that Richard is just unstoppable is more convincing than any other credit that he could have. And, you know, if Richard is really able to get professional people on board, I think this movie can be really a big hit, depending on how it's cast. And, of course, we need funding, so that's the number one thing we have to kind of conquer. But my understanding is there are more interests now that Richard has been putting this out over and over and over again. And so this is how I made my film, by the way. So I I really am a big advocate for Richard getting support for this, financial support and otherwise, because what I did was basically started this project and everybody was kind of discrediting me because I was very young at the time and all I had was my passion. And I just kept going and going and going, and eventually people realized that I meant business. And this is exactly what should be happening to Richard's project, is that he means business, he means to make this a great uh, success, and he should definitely get support.